Welcome back to GTA 5 today, where in this video, in this video, we're going to be trying 100 viral TikToks in GTA 5. Let's get into it. So this first viral TikTok here involves the wheel of the casino, and apparently if you use the method in the TikTok, you win the vehicle every single time. So let's go try it. So this is the multi-million dollar car that we can win, and that's the wheel right there. Let's go spin it. So literally all the viral TikTok says to do is go up, grab the wheel, count to five, and then spin. So one, two, three, and then tap. Let's see what it does. Uh, oh, bu move, Bunky. I can't see, man. No way. There's no way. What? <laughs> what? That's like the second time I've ever... No way, man. I did not expect that to work. Let's go, dude. All right, let's move on to the next viral TikTok. I literally don't believe this. It doesn't look real, but it is. It's got to do with revolver or any revolver in GTA Online. Uh, you literally just equipped it. You, you click a few buttons and then your last bullet turns into like a thousand bullets. It's crazy. Now, I've been practicing it for like, what is he doing? For like 10 minutes now, and uh, I think I've got it down. Also, hit that like button three times. All right, are you ready to watch this? Check this out. You take out your revolver, normal things, right? And then both buttons, boop, it shoots up in the air. Did you see that? Now, watch. One, I'm doing it. Two, I can count. Look at me. Three, this last bullet. Are you ready? Check this out. <laughs> He's on fire! Uh-oh, don't do it. <laughs> Why was that so much scarier in first person? Did you see that? And it works with every revolver too. Look at this. We got another semi truck just hanging out here. What's he doing? Don't know. About to blow up though. Boom. One, two, three, and then. How have I just known about this now, monkey? Huh? What about you? You knew about this? Oh, that's a really nice car to blow up, but we're gonna do it anyways, cause we've got to. You know what I mean? It's for science, so. It's a strong car. Wow. Oh no, 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 it's. The trunk's on fire. That doesn't... Oh, the, there's no fire in here. What was... <laughs> where did the fire come from, man? Oh, did you try and hit it with a bat? That doesn't work. That does work. Moving on from that absolutely insane glitch. I didn't know that was even possible, and I'm really proud of myself for that. Um, we have the indestructible limo glitch. This doesn't look legit at all, but you... Mm -hmm. The limo literally turns into like a Twinkie that somebody steps on, you know? I've never stepped on a Twinkie, but that's just the first thing that came to my mind was looks like a Twinkie that's burnt and it's gotten stepped on. Uh, y'all ever been picked up by a monkey in a limo before? <coughs> no. Me, me neither, really. This is the first time for everything. I'm sure it'll be fine though, right? Yes, Jeeves. Yes. Please take us downtown, Jeeves. What it- Jeeves name? Yeah, that'd be a good name. Monkey or Jeeves? I don't- Oh no, th this isn't the spot that we're supposed to be, monkey. He's not- look, this dude knows what he's doing, he's not gonna run us over, do you see that? You're- you're not driving anymore. Nope, 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 get out. Oh god, <laughs> there's the train! Wait, 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 I'm not ready, hold on. Uh, this is- this is about right, I think. Yeah, nothing could go wrong. I like how monkeys is back there, like, where do we go? What's- what's happening? Oh! Wait a minute! Wait! Are we in the- Uh... I don't understand what just happened. Why did we just get put? We got pushed under the map. This thing looks destroyed. I wonder what happened to it. I got hit by a train. Yeah, all right. I'm trying that again. Apparently, you can do this unlimited times and the car won't blow up. That doesn't make any sense to me, but... And it's still drivable? Does that... Oh, yeah, it's still drivable. She's good. She's mint. Just a little tiny bit messed up. That's all. Totally fine, though. For this next one, I'm gonna back it in here like this, rather than drive it in, just so we can mess up the the entire thing properly. You know, you don't want to do you don't want to do one side more than the other. Look at that distinguished gentleman in the back there. Look at him, huh? That's just a monkey millionaire. He found a lottery ticket, boom, became a millionaire. Now he just orders me around to get run over by trains. This story's a little bit flawed. I'm not gonna lie. Oh God, there it is again. That's fine. It's fun, really. It is, but it's just kind of. I don't want to go through the map again. Maybe I turn the wheel? Yeah, I'll put the brakes on, too. Oh! Oh, oh my- We're on fire, monkey! Put it out! We're on fire! Don't throw snowballs on it! Use your fire extinguisher, man! Come on! Oh, God, here we go. Again. Oh! You know, it honestly makes this thing look way cooler every time it happens. Here it comes again, monkey. You better hold on to your banana. Ooh! That wasn't as bad as- Ooh. As it could have been. Really? Uh-oh. Hold on a minute. Hold on. I seem to be in a sticky wicket. Oh. There's a campfire in the front of the- There's a campfire in the front of the limo here. Yeah, yeah, put it out, put it out. Oh, see, that's a good- That's a good boy. 
That's a- that's a good boy. It's not working, but you're trying. That's all that matters, right? Try a little harder, man! Come on, please! Hey, are you done trying or something? <sighs> monkey giveth and monkey taketh away. That's how that works. Well, you got yourself a new and improved ramp car 3.0, everybody. That's exactly what that looks like right now. Alright, this next one I know for a fact is absolutely insane. But you can get a friend to blow up the car that you're in, and you can continue to drive it. Right? Let me show you. And my friend is a monkey here, right? So let's say that I want to take this car. Uh, all monkey has to do is throw his little sticky on there. Boop. I have to break this window open, and I sit my butt down, and then when I go over... When I go over, I'm hot wiring the car, and we're good to go. <laughs> I just spit all over myself. Ew. Just casually driving a burning vehicle, everybody. Don't try this at home. <laughs> or do. It's up to you. I like how my guy was legitimately hot wiring this thing as it's burning. I'm just like, this is fine. This is fine. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, I mean, honey, I said put the heat on, not start a fire. It's kind of just a really good way. You're kind of like a rotisserie chicken in here, right? Like, look at that. Romantic. Kind of nice, cool design, right? You'd be a hit at car shows. Anyways. Oh, great! The fire department's here! Yeah, that's great, guys. Really appreciate you. He doesn't, though. Oh! The fire department's fighting back? They're not- You can't win that fight. Wow! He's like an Avenger, bro! Is that Captain America? Alright, alright, that's a little much, man. Alright, man. This next one just looks insane, not just because of the- the money glitch easy part, but you drive through a mountain and there's a tree under there. Imagine if I said that sentence anywhere else, it sounds so weird. What'd you do today? I drove, over, I drove under a mountain and there was a tree there. Something really scary about a monkey on an oppressor Mark II behind you. Like, really scary, you know what I mean? It's like a mosquito, but worse. <gasps> like a wasp! I feel like this is gonna be like one of those gotcha, you know? Like I'm just gonna smash into the side of the mountain and fall down and look like an absolute idiot. At least I didn't fall off, though. At least I didn't fall off, I don't look stupid. That wasn't even the right spot, actually, it's right up here, I think? Yikes. Just kidding. I got this. Hold on. Are you ready? Watch. Right here. I'm gonna boost into it. That's how confident I am. Alright, I think it's right here, maybe? Right right here. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. It's- I'm, I'm getting, like, stuck on this? Hold- get- Whoa. <laughs> Alrighty then. I was- I- I'm in. We're here. Now where's this tree at? Supposed to be an infamous tree around here that I can shoot missiles at? Where- where is it? Don't tell me there's no tree in here, man! I'm inside of a mountain right now! Come on! I need my money! Where's the tree? Oh! <gasps> is that the tree right there? That looks like- that looks more like a bush than a tree. Wait a minute. It could be a tiny tree. Oh, it's an actual tree. What the- wait! What is, that looks like the smallest tree in the world, man! What is that thing doing? Alright, shoot rockets at it, Spears. See what happens. I missed. I missed. I mi- uh, did that go through? Oh, this is an evasive tree. Okay, I- I got you. Hold on. Alright. Do it! Give me my money! There we go! Where's my money? No money. Isn't that- isn't that impressive, monkey? No money, huh? I can't even hit you if I tried, man. Literally! What are these rockets- Oh! No! Monkey! Where are you? Oh, he's in the abyss. He fell into another galaxy. Hopefully there's other monkeys in that galaxy, you know, he's- I think he's tired here with me. Alrighty then, I just... spawned at a farm. That's kinda good. Uh, oh, wait, what is that right there? What is that? Whoa. Thank you, game. That's so kind. Look at that tra- alrighty then. This next one here actually looks super cool. Um, you go to the fire station downtown, and you can like, up and atomize yourself up on top of like a- a locker, and you- teleport into the roof somehow. I've always wanted to go into the roof of a fire station, and apparently there's money there. I don't even care about the money, man. Alright, here we are, the good old fire station, where money is made, and... being up in the roofs is done. Also, where are the firefighters at, though? Oh, that's where they are. You dealt with them, didn't you? Alright, we come over to this corner here. Oh, there he is again. Nice. Oh, man, come on now. We go into this corner right here, with the shiny blue barrels, and we're trying to up ourselves onto the atomizer there. So like, this? Oh, there's no way I'm sitting up here like a doll. <laughs> I was sitting up there like something at a Toy Story. What was that? Hey, you wanna sign my foot? Alrighty then, so we're up here. Where's- where's your hat at, monkey? Where- 
Oh, the money was supposed to be awarded to us by the time we, we teleported up through here, so it, it wasn't, but we're up here searching around, because that's what we do. What are you pointing at right now? Why are you pointing at that? <gasps> There's- can we- can I go down that? No, right? No. <laughs> Firefighter roleplay, anybody? I'm going back up there for that one. That's- that's cool. Oh, see, that's how that should have happened the first time. Yeah, yeah, we got a fire on Dispatch 96, Road 97 and a half. Oh, there is? I'm coming, don't worry! Oh! Yeah, you just might want to put the up and atomizer away. Those things go off randomly for no reason. All right, this next one looks pretty ridiculous. I guess you can drive a Deluxo under certain bridges, and you literally go in the bridge. Like, you're not just driving under, you're going inside of the bridge, which is <laughs> different. All right, so you just gotta smash into it at the- at the right angle here. Just below there, and then... Oh, we're in! We're in! <laughs> Look at us! We're underneath the bridge and inside of it. But, I guess you can also, like, shoot up through it? So if there's a car coming across here, let's see if this works. This would be the ultimate troll right here. Uh-oh. 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 I just threw a sticky right there in that corner, and I'm gonna blow it up when that car drives over and see if it does anything. <laughs> That's unfair. You can literally- it's an invisible mine at that point. What the- I wonder what happens when I get out of it. Does it just stay? Oh, what the- You can literally just like inspect people's cars from under here? Yeah, officer, your uh, suspension's looking a little bit weak there. Yeah, you can't do anything. You can't do anything. I'm down here chilling, and you're up there dead. Uh-oh, one over there. I got him. Oh yeah, you can also launch missiles from underneath. Just kidding. This one, I guess, isn't really so much a glitch, as it's just insane looking. Like, genuinely insane. Alright. I wasn't even looking at my screen, alright? Mr. Little Monkey. Alright, so we got our- we got our gas attendant here slipping on the gas. <laughs> He's just covering this thing, bro. That's- I think that's probably enough, man. That's good. That's good. So you just get in it, right? As you do, normally, and you boost straight up. But if you look behind you, I'm trying to go straight up. I can't boost straight up, I'm just on fire. Oh, yeah, I gotta press E, I forgot. I'm so dumb. Here, do it again. Do it again real quick. Pour it on my car, I meant. Yep. 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 That is just... a very odd... <laughs> odd thing to see. Yeah, that's what we wanted right there, look at that! It looks like something out of a movie, right? That's what it should look like at all times. So basically, you just get your friend on a bike, and you two kind of, like, stick together somehow, and create some infinite speed loop glitch that makes you faster than anything in GTA Online. Oh, you and that bat, man, I swear. Oh! All right, perfect. All right, we got two BMX but mountain bikes. What are these? We got a monkey and me and a soup. All right, so let's try it. It, it looks easy, but uh, the monkey's got way more powerful legs than I do too. All right, let's give it a try here. Turn in, turn into me, turn into me. Not like that. Trying to lock it in with a with a primate. Shake and bake, baby. Come on now, Ricky Bobby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, oh, that's way too fast. That's way too fast for bicycles. <laughs> Did you see how fast we were going? Oh no, and we didn't even do it right. Oh! Alright, come on, little guy. Right over here. Hey, I got a banana. There you go. There you go. <gasps> oh, it was so fast for a second. See, all you gotta do is listen to Spears, man. Well, it's still very fast. <laughs> nah. mm. <sighs> oh, that's... Oh, that's easy to do. Oh, that's so fast! We're on a pedal bike! Uh, it's just hard to communicate with monkey, you know, because I don't speak monkey. Uh, but we got stupid fast for a little bit. Um, this next one here actually looks really, really difficult. All you have to do is get your oppressor Mark II, find a tall building, and fly up it, and pull up and back, and you'll go upside down. And while you're upside down, you can either, like, you can pump forward and backwards, and you just go stupid fast. On top of the fact that you're flying upside down, looks pretty cool. I really don't want to do this one. The building might be a little bit too tall. Oh, that should be a good building right here, right? All right, so just fly up. Oh, do I have to boost or anything, or do I just fly up? And you just fly up and keep pulling back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Who comes up with these things? Wait, 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 wait. Whoa! Uh, forward, and then pull back, and then hold it. Oh, that's a little bit easier. Oh, that's a lot easier. And then you start, like, like thrusting the air a little bit. Up and down, like this. <laughs> it looks like I'm taking a poop upside down right now, bro. There we go. This is so hard to do. It doesn't come across right on camera, but I'm struggling in real life right now. What is my character doing? Ah! 
My neighbors think I'm insane. Bro, the impressor's about to blow- Oh. Alright. Thank you. It is really satisfying, though. I'm not gonna lie to you right now. I couldn't lie to you and say that it's not fun to do, but it's not the easiest- Please, Dom! Not right now! I don't even know you, dude! Alright, up, down, up, down, up, yup. You can actually kind of tell it's a little bit quicker. <laughs> just when you thought it couldn't get any weirder, huh? It just did. We're gonna be flying upside down with a soup on an MK2 oppressor. All of this makes no sense. Am I in a dream right now? I might be dreaming. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Now, I'm gonna try and boost, actually, while we're doing this. Let- <laughs> Wait, wait, boost? Mm, up, down, up, down. This is something I never thought I'd be doing in my life, in this game. But here we are, right? Making dreams come true, everybody. <laughs> How do we not just hit the ground right there? Power lines, oh, oh. My worst nightmare. Oh, no. I'm trying not to hurt soup here either, man, because- uh, mm. Are you still on it? Help! There's no way. Uh, are you- Are you good, man? Here, you'll be fine. Just breathe, man. There you go. The three best friends that anybody could ever have right here. This is about to be a Guinness World Record on flying upside down on a jet bike with a monkey and a soup. And a Spears. Don't forget myself. I can't forget that. With all three, baby. Look at us. Look at us. Wait. We're fine. Eh, this- it feels like I'm having a dream that I can't control. That's exactly what this feels like. You ever have a dream where you're trying to punch and you can't? Mm-hmm. That's me. By the way, if you guys ever want to talk to me, uh, you can check out my Instagram down in the description. It's just Spears the Amazing HD. Uh, give it a follow and send me a message. I love talking to people on there. That's what I do in my off time, you know? Hey, you can send me this picture, too. I think it would be funny. All right, for this next one, literally all you need is the Faggio, and you get on it, just modify it, do whatever. It's extremely, like, stupid slow when you drive it normally. Like, Monkey is our speedometer, not Monkey. Soup is our speedometer right here on the back. He's gonna tell us exactly how fast we're going. I'm gonna guess we might be doing, like, I don't know, three? We're doing 50 miles. Okay, so for this glitch, legit, all you have to do is a little bit of a wheelie. And I don't know if it's the mass amount of mirrors on this thing, or lights, or whatever, but for some reason, you start to go stupid quick, very, very slowly. So we went from 50 to 75. And, and, and just to show you how much quicker it is, let's, let's go... What was that? Alright, so this- that, he's gonna drive normally, I'm gonna drive doing a wheelie. One, two, three. And then, I'm gonna pop a wheelie, and he's gonna drive normally. It's already immense. Look at that. You could literally park a fair amount of traffic in between us right now. You see that? Eventually, he's just gonna disappear out of the camera. He's disappearing. He's gone. Hey, this scooter's not useless after all, you know what I mean? It's got a purpose in life. Alright, so I've actually seen this one before, but, uh, we've never done it like this. Um, it's pretty much you just come to this spot where vehicles, like, melt. Uh, when you drive into the corner over here. You're supposed to use the, uh, the LG, like, the GTR, but I guess you can do it with other vehicles and it works better. And speaking of other vehicles, this one right here. I don't believe that it works with other vehicles, but I've seen a lot of people doing it, so, uh, I'm gonna try it out here. Soup's got the fire truck ready. Uh, he's fighting the firefighters to keep the truck. Bro, what? Oh, man. Oh, he's winning somehow. Wow. That is impressive. Uh-oh. Monkey's coming over to- Oh, that's a sucker punch, bro. Oh, I can see it starting to kind of bend in the front there a little bit. I keep going deeper into that little, like, corner. Eventually, I'm not gonna be able to get out of it. Oh, no. The paramedics are here now. Don't. Don't. Oh, he did it! Oh, uh, I'm just trying to do a glitch here, man. And there it goes. He's on fire now, too. <gasps> oh, it's, it's, it's kind of working. You see the shaking right now on my screen? That's how you know- Whoa. Ambulance came back with a vengeance. Uh, oh yeah. You see me in there? Looks like I'm doing something very inappropriate, but I'm not. Uh, I'm stuck? I can't move. No, no, please. No, I can't move. Help. Help. You see what I mean? I got myself wedged. Oh, wait. Unwedge me, please. Mm, I, 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 I need someone to hit me. I need someone to hit me. Just kidding. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. I was just kidding. We are unstucketh. And I'm gonna see if that made us any faster. So this is just a bone stock Hellcat right now. No mods other than, you know, the, the broken, destroyed front end. All right, that was 116. Okay, let's see if we can beat 116. All right, back to the uh, pan spray here. <laughs> this is how you just make any vehicle quicker. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, too much, too much. It's gonna blow up. Yep, please stop, please. 
Oh, I'm dabbing. Yep. <laughs> We're both- Soup is dabbing really hard right now. Alright, back her out there. We're good. Right, so that was, a, that was a little bit better. A little bit more crushed. Oh, bro. That feels way faster, and the car's kind of bouncing around a little bit. I, it doesn't look the best, but you know, that melted look is in. It's kind of like a new wrap. Oh, this is stupid fast. What the? This is a bone stock vehicle with a broken front end. I don't understand GTA physics, man. Oh, it's even more broken now. How fast is that, soup? 191? Uh, <laughs> wow. That's, um, kind of unbelievable, but alrighty then. Well, the motor's is sort of not in the center of the vehicle anymore. Maybe that has something to do with it. This is, uh, it's kind of impressive. So it doesn't, it doesn't work with the Elegy, but it works with... A, 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 Hel a Hellcat? I don't, a Challenger? I don't understand how that works, but... Uh, it makes sense to me! Huh. Would you look at that? This next one here is actually a jet glitch. It's the Hydra speed glitch. Now, this is an absolutely ridiculous speed glitch, and it's so funny that it has to do with, like, a jet, because nobody really uses jets much in this game. It's mostly, like, just cars. But all you have to do is swim through the air, if that makes any sense. It, it doesn't make any sense, but y you'll see. Don't do it. You are just... You're probably thinking to yourself, did this guy just say we're gonna be swimming through the air? Yes. Yes, we are, alright? So you literally just thrust forward, alright? I feel like I'm in the new Top Gun movie right now. You thrust for- I haven't even seen it. You thrust forward, and you go down, and as you go down, you pull the brake, and then boost forward. So, down, brake. Yeah, just like that. Oh yeah, you can see when the speed takes in, because the camera zooms right out. But you just keep doing this. And you can literally go across the map in like, a second. You know? One, two, just like that, three, four, and then boop! Look at that. Wow! Missiles are so slow now, compared to our jet. Look at that. It's like a poster, just standing up there. Are you- I guess he's gonna tell us how fast we're going from up there, somehow. This is it. We're gonna get to see exactly how fast you can go doing the swimming Hydra glitch. Uh, it's, it's satisfying when you get to do it. Like, when you actually get in the rhythm. Just like I imagine, you know, swimming is. Or solving a Rubik's Cube. I don't know why. It's just something I can't do. Basic math. This is fun, though. How, how fast are we going right now? Oh, yeah. Faster than a missile. Superman's like, wow, that guy's quick! <coughs> Sorry, it's coughed like an iPad kid there. I th I might be at the max speed right now. Not 100% sure. The the city's coming up quick though. Like real quick. I'm gone over the city now. It's been like a like 12 seconds. Oh, that was close. All right. How fast was that? Soup. What was that? That was 340 miles per hour. I've never gone 340 miles an hour ever. He said that it might go Honestly, it's probably 400 and something. That's... that's very quick. In a jet, even. In this game. This next one, this dude actually called me out. Uh, he said that I was scared if I didn't try this. It's the Comet SR speed glitch. You literally just kick the back of the car, and it's supposed to go faster. I don't even think this works, so... Soup, that doesn't... How did you get a snow car... It's... We're in the desert right now. What? Alright, so we literally just kick this rear corner panel, like, he said 10 times, so... Can we talk about how seven, eight, my foot, nine, ten is literally made out of, like, steel to do that? Like, what did I just do to the back there? Alright, so that's a non-kicked one, and this is a kicked one. You ready? There's three, three honks, alright? So let's, let's see. Wow. Alright, is that- the car's starting to bounce around a bunch too? Well, that's like vibrating, what the hell? You see that? Uh, alrighty then. Uh, I'm just trying to give him a head start here. God, <laughs> that first race was so bad. It was like he was standing still the whole time. Anyways, so this thing, I guess the glitch is it's supposed to vibrate. Oh yeah, it's vibrating. Oh yeah, it's... It, I'm definitely passing him right now. Like, very oddly though. It's, it's... I mean, it's faster, but not by much. <laughs> I'm so scared. Here's the next one here. It's a Faria glitch without popping the tires. You have to shoot the center of all four wheels until it drops a little bit, and then you kick the back of it. What is it with kicking the cars, man? Alright, so we shoot all corners until it lowers twice here. There's one... and then... two? One? Two? And then... Uh, one... two, I think. Is that right? And then you kick the back five to eight times to... Alright, we've got the exact same vehicle here. Soup's gonna throw a nade, and we're gonna go when it blows. So, literally identical other than, you know, I did the little glitch on this one. So there's a fair start. 
He's right behind me. Oh, man. This thing is vibrating all over the place. We're doing like 200? Oh my... All right. That's... Uh, no. I might have just messed it up because I hit the back. I hit the worst spot. Oh. All right, I'm going to do the biggest flex. You go, I'll catch up, Soup. I might have let him go for too long, but we'll see. This is like literally one of the fastest cars in the game anyways, so... Oh, just kidding. Wow. That's so fast, dude. What? That doesn't make any sense. I didn't think it would be- Oh, that's bad. Oh. Soup's gonna tell us how fast we're going here because obviously that speedometer just doesn't work. I also might have messed it up by flying into like a tree and cactus and other vehicle and stuff. But see what he says. Oh, righty then. Through the air doesn't count, obviously. Oh god. 169? That's the best number ever. Wow. Fun facts about GTA vehicles, part one. Literally, all you need is a jetpack. <laughs> That's all you need. You fly it up and go as fast as you can in a straight line, and you literally can't get blown up by missiles. Uh, looks ridiculous. I don't know if I believe that, but it's gotta be true, right? So we got our jetpack here, and we have something that has missiles right there. This doesn't look like it's gonna go well. All right, I'm about to get blown up real quick. Check this out. Y'all ever seen a monkey on a jetpack before? I, just, I had to show you this. His little feet don't even touch. Look, hold on. I wonder if I can take him off of Oh, no! Oh, he's- he's done way worse to me. Alright, let's go. Come on. <laughs> oh, there's a missile incoming. There's a missile incoming! I don't think I was at top speed. You know what the problem was? I, uh, I didn't have my landing gear up. Uh, missiles are incoming. Lots of missiles. I can hear multiple. Oh, it doesn't look like I'm- Oh, here they come. Oh! Oh! It was- it like hit an invisible wall behind me or something. I can't even see it. Oh, pfft! <laughs> Uh oh, here it comes. Oh, yeah. Yep. Something tells me this isn't supposed to be like this. You know what I mean? Like, it's a really cool fact, but like, look at how overpowered that is. That was a great angle. It's like a guardian angel. Look at that. Nothing. The rockers are like, what am I hitting here, man? Nothing's blowing up. That's crazy. I like this thing a lot. I don't want to be in it anymore, though. It's annoying. All right, so this next one here is useful facts in GTA Part 10. Basically, all you gotta do is grab a flare gun, get your friend or, you know, somebody that's messing with you in a helicopter, and shoot your flare gun at the helicopter, and their missiles will come back and blow them up. Come on now. Oh! That one came right back. Here we go. Wait a minute. I gotta, like, shoot it over him so the, the missiles are like, Oh, what's that? What's that shiny thing in the sky there? Oh! Oh, that one came back. <gasps> oh! I feel like Harry Potter right now. This is great. I love it. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Oh! Let's go, dude! Oh, that was- that took me like an hour and a half to do. That was satisfying, though. Really satisfying. What the- Alright, this one doesn't even look real, but a lot of people were sending me this. You basically take- I think that's the Guardian truck, and you can pretty much drive this thing underwater. I feel like as soon as I get in the water, the truck's just gonna stop working, but this is the tunnel right here, and we're supposed to drive underneath that, all the way up and around into, like, where all the houses are. Why am I inside this truck right now? What it- <laughs> Alright, let's go. Boat truck activated. Let's see, uh... Somehow this is working so far. Am I- can I- I can't even go first person, can I? Nope. Oh, I'm- <laughs> I'm running out of oxygen right now. I'm underwater. Somehow my truck is still running, but I'm slowly dying because I can't breathe. Oh, good. Look at me. How'd you die? Oh, I was driving my truck in the water and I drowned. I can't say this has ever crossed my mind to be like, hey, let's take this truck through the water. But, uh, mm-hmm. Literally probably like my favorite truck now, ever. We're driving on the bottom of this, like, little river thing. Damn, I don't know what this is. Sewage? Probably. This is probably just poop water. We're just driving in poop. Got some poop in my mouth. Monkey doesn't care. He's like, yeah, I normally throw this at people, so this is fine. I need to see this in the daylight, because it doesn't... I'm doing it, but I don't believe I'm doing it. Oh, yeah, we're doing it 100%. Look at us. Just the big... <laughs> what? <laughs> what happens if I get out, though? That's the that's the big question. I'm gonna get out. Ugh. You can just open the door and get in it? <laughs> what? Bro, the entire thing's full of water. Oh, it still just drives like no problem. That makes complete sense. This is actually faster than most boats. Yeah. Whatever, man. Whatever. Can you imagine living in these houses? Look at that guy, he's recording. He's like, what is that thing? What? Is that a truck in the water? Living in these houses and you look out, you just see this driving by. You're like, oh, honey, they're at it again. Let's say you're done with the water. You just drive out. Your truck's all clean. Probably the cleanest it'll ever be. And this next one here is useless facts in GTA part 39. Come to this location on your oppressor mark two, and then you literally just drive it into this clothing store. And somehow you can fly around in the rafters or inside the walls of the clothing. I don't understand that. Yes, honey, I'm just going to. Oh my! Oh, 
That was actually a jump scare. That scared me so much. All right, we're heading over to this clothing store now. I'm gonna look real stupid if I do this and it doesn't work. Hold on. Yeah, this is this is right. Hey guys, watch this. Hold on. Ah! I'm all right. I'm all right. I didn't even. I, I meant to do that. So I'm gonna try that one more time here. Yup. It just. Uh, you just. You don't want to go too fast with it. That's that's it. You just want to enjoy. Ugh. All right. Thirteenth time is a charm here, everybody. That is how the old saying goes. <laughs> oh. Please just work. You got it. Mm. My face is just casually cracking the floor right there. And up we go. How is it made to look so easy, man? Whoa! Did you just open the door when I was trying to do that? <laughs> Alright, that works. There we go. Why? Are you- are you barbecuing over here? I didn't know you- I didn't know you could do that. What? Yup, right on that one. Alright, we're up here finally. <laughs> After 18 hours, the whole crew's here, but I'm scared to walk around because I feel like I'm just gonna get squished again. Like... Uh, that's fun. It's like a little mini game up there. It's just like see how long you can walk around before you get squished. All right, so this next one here says fun facts about GTA vehicles part two. Uh, basically, all you need to do is grab the Runer 2000, and when somebody tries to walk up and open your door and it's locked, they get stunned for like a few seconds and they're just on the ground shaking. It's so funny to watch, and I kind of want to see Monkey do it. First things first, I gotta buy the Runer, which is a, <laughs> a lot of money, but oh yeah, there it is. Alright, buy now. There we go. That was easy. All I had to do was buy a vehicle warehouse, too. <laughs> that was a lot of money! Alright, monkey, listen. I just spent a lot of money to watch you do something, alright? It was like seven million dollars. Alright, what are you pointing at? What is- Now when I point at this car, you try and open the door, okay? Good boy. Good boy. Alright, here it is right here. Come here. Come here. You ready? Unlock that. Right now. Open it. Use your- use your little paws. Right here. This one. God, he's so- Yep. Hey, come here. Come here. There you go. Oh! He's just sleeping. Oh, uh, like a wizard. I literally spent eight million dollars just to see that. Just so everybody's like, aware. This one might be the most useless fact I've ever seen in my life, but you literally just go to the beach, and there's like this ice cream or like french fry place, and you can climb the sign, and uh, you're supposed to go through the wall, but I think it just crushes you. I need to see this in person. I don't know what Soup's up to, he's... Yeah. Oh, silly me. It's- it's- it's a shark place. What? You just get shark here. Alright, that's cool. Oh wait, burgers? Never mind. And tacos. Oh, good, good. Never had a shark taco before. Oh, onion rings. Nice. Oh, wow. Hey, guys. You showed up. That's cool. Uh-oh. That's not gonna be good. That's gonna be bad. Oh, I knew that was gonna end so bad for him. And his friend over there. That's my car. They're good friends. Alright, let's see. I don't know why you're even able to do this. That makes no sense. <laughs> What? I don't really even get why it's an option to climb up this. Like, what if you're just standing here reading the sign? You're like, oh, I guess I- Oh, let's go! Oh, oh, I hate these prices on this sign! I'm gonna climb it! This next one here is Useless Facts in GTA Part 40. Basically, all you gotta do is come to this road in the middle of nowhere, and I guess the NPCs just don't know how to drive? I need to see this for myself, because I don't believe that. I feel like we're about to watch a fireworks show or something. Oh, here we go. Oh, he took that corner a little sharp. Not too bad, though. I mean, that could have been way worse. Oh, that was like Tokyo Drift, bro. That thing did- what the- Alright, I don't know why there's a minivan right there. I don't know why there's a- Where did that minivan come from? Uh, oh boy, this minivan's gonna- Oh! What? That was cool. This man's like, oh, you know what? I was going that way, but I don't have to go that way anymore. I'm gonna go this way now. Oh, this guy's coming in way too hot. Oh! <gasps> None of them know how to drive. That's- uh, He doesn't know what he's doing, man. What are you doing, dude? It's a, I don't, uh... What was that? Bro, did one of them just blow up? <laughs> Wait, what? Uh... I'm kind of frightened right now. Should we be standing here? They're, I'm a bit frightened. Alrighty then. No, something's going on. The car shouldn't be blowing up on impact, right? Like, how fast are they coming down this hill, man? Oh, go away. Just average LA drivers right here, everybody. <laughs> That one just went into the abyss. He definitely went right through that house. There's no shot. Where is it? It's gone. Can't even see it. Huh. Yeah, so if you wanna, you know, just watch the, watch the fireworks, just come to this corner and, and watch these cars. Bro, those firefighters down there are like, what is happening right now? I'm just gonna stand here with Monkey because he seems like he knows what he's doing, so... Let's just, let's just hang out here for a moment, Monkey. He just got 
I think Monkey's dead, actually. Is Monkey dead? Oh! Yeah. I am. Here's, a, here's another one. Useless Facts GTA Part 38. Come to this location, which is down in like the swamp area by the um, military base, and you call a cab, and the cab will legitimately just drive into the water to get you. Bro, what is with the cabs in this game? Last time I called a taxi in this game, it was hilarious. Uh, by the way, look how I'm running right now. What? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna pull up my phone here and give a taxi a call. Car has been sent. Should be with you soon. Good. Good, I like that. Just two- two modders casually running through the swamp right- They look like the best of friends, don't they? Where's my taxi cab? Just sitting here waiting. This is terrible service. There's no way. There's no way! What are you doing, man? Wait a minute. Did you just beep at me? There's no way you just beeped at me. I'm getting in. Why are you staring at me like that, man? I don't like this. Um... Just take me to Los Santos Customs. Sure. Take- Take me there. Let's see what happens. Oh, you're gonna drive into the deeper part, aren't you? Not very smart. How is he- Oh, you're just stuck now, aren't you? You're like, oh, oh no. I know the water's too deep on that side. Not gonna lie, this dude's a better driver than I am. Oh no, he's driving right back through that. I'm calling another cab, because that's ridiculous, man. There's no way Buddy makes it through that. Thank you for calling. Uh, you're trying to sink one of our cars. Don't worry. Car's on the way. What'd you do to her now? Oh, drove her in a swamp. Come on. Here he comes. Here he comes. I'm right here, man. Oh, that's a little deep. Uh-oh. Did you sink? Yeah, you did. Oh, that sucks, man. What a- what a dummy, huh? There's a, just this one part is a little bit too deep, and the thing is just broken. They're like, flagging my phone, I'm like, I'm never sending him another taxi cab, ever. This next one here is Useless Facts in GTA Part 30, and I can't wait to try this with Monkey, but you literally just go up to this random alley, and there's some red pipes, and when you shoot them, I don't know what comes out of them, like helium or some high-pressure gas, but it literally blows you over when you walk into it. That doesn't make any sense, and I want to try it. I'll try it with a human first. Hey, Soup, come here. Hey. K hey, come here. Alright, stay there. Don't move, alright? Oh, God. Is that sh- I'm sh- it There's two coming out. Hey, look at that! Can I just go like this? Oh, no. Oh, that's just gonna keep him on the ground. Yeah. Can I do it to myself? Probably. The steam's keeping me on the ground, I can't get up! Hey, monkey, come here, man! Come here! Hey, we just gotta show you something! Hey! Stand right there, alright? Don't move! Oh, God! How is he- Wait! How <laughs> is that not knocking him over? He's just flying away! Wait, what? Alright, stay there. I'm gonna- I'm gonna back up a little bit more here. That doesn't make any sense. He's just getting higher and higher! What- Oh! Are you good? Oh, no- Oh, no! Oh... <laughs> Oh man, that's uh, yeah, he left some money though, that's good. <laughs> yeah, you know, this is hours of fun for somebody like me. Just with like a really undeveloped brain. Um, and they're on this side too, they're- Oh god! Help! Help! Alrighty then. Looks like soup, uh, soup hit a water main there. I don't know what- Oh, oh, oh. oh that's uh, that's some really watered grass. That grass is gonna be healthy, for sure. So this one here is, uh, how to do a Deluxo stanced glitch. Uh, I don't think I even own a Deluxo, so I'm gonna have to buy one of those. But, uh, you get in, you get out of it, you shoot up in the air, and then you get back in the vehicle, and then start it. I don't know, there's a lot of steps to it, we're gonna, we're gonna buy the Deluxo first here. It looks super cool though, so I, I do wanna try this. <laughs> I mean, obviously you wanna try it, Spears. That's literally why you're making this video, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Dude, my ears just popped, and I feel like I can hear letters, almost? You know what I mean? Like, or like the weather changing? Did I just gain a superpower? Yo, who pooped on my window? What is that? <laughs> Ew! Alright, here's the deluxe. So we gotta put some nice wheels on it first, and maybe paint it a different color, and then we can do, hopefully, the glitch. Would this even be considered a glitch? It must be. The, the, there's gotta be a reason it is, you know what I mean? It was labeled as a glitch, so it must be. Alright, so let's see, with the Deluxo, you... So you get out of it, uh, walk away from it for a second, let it sit, uh... Alright, get in, sit there, get out, shoot... Oops. No! No! Please, sir, I'm in the middle of something! Security guards always thinking there's something else, man, like they're Superman. Like, come on, bro, you pulled me out of my car. I'm smoking cigarettes here, what are you doing pulling me out of my car? Out, and it's just gonna hover. And then, you go into vehicle controls, uh, remote control functions, engine off. No way! That is a cool- I don't know if I would consider that a glit- I guess because you have to shoot up in the air, but that looks so cool! What?! Oh my god. Well, I mean, it looks broken, but seeing this drive down the road, that's neat. 
I wonder what happens, well obviously when you get in it's gonna turn back on, I don't even know why I asked that. You have received $2,000 for continued good behavior. <gasps> Thank you! Just to test it without the shooting, I, I, I just did it, like, without getting out and then boom, you know? It, and it dropped anyways, so you don't... <laughs> oh man, these TikToks are so funny. This next one is called the uh, GTA Online Fire Nitro. Um, so you get a car that spits flames, obviously. So we're gonna go with the, the Hellcat, the Gauntlet. And then you pour some, uh, get a jerry can and pour some gas on the ground behind the vehicle and the back bumper. And magic happens. And by magic, I mean fire nitro. Whatever, whatever fire nitro is. I thought regular nitro was good enough, but, you know, can never be good enough, can it? I also gotta go buy a gas can because don't have one of those, so taking a trip to uh, ammunition really quick. Maybe I can snort some and it'll get rid of, like, this cold or something. That'd be nice. Oh, I hate that color so much, bro. Ew. Ew. So we're definitely gonna want to armor this thing up real quick and then make it look a little bit better. All right, it looks a little better. <laughs> Just the supercharger makes it look good. That's all. Oh, these guys are having a car meet at the casino, dude. I wasn't even invited. Let's go. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna park outside of their car meet and get my fire nitro ready and then pull in with the fire nitro on. This is gonna be funny. All right, they're never gonna suspect a thing. Ever. Never ever. Uh, give me my can, please. There we go. I got it. My voice is slowly disappearing, but that's fine. All right, they told you to pour some up here. No problem. And then down here, you get a puddle. Two puddles, maybe. Maybe three puddles. Depends on how many puddles you want. You know what I mean? Big puddle, small. And then you get in, and it should just off the startup. There we go. Yeah! Look at that! Wow, they don't call us the Hell Gauntlet for no reason. Oh my god! What's up, everybody? I'm here with my Fire Nitro. Ooh, it's gone. Wait. Hey, I'm, I'm back again, everybody, with my Fire Nitro. Oh, my bumper's flying off. Hey, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, can I light somebody on fire with this? Hold on. Uh, no, you can't. But he goes, dude, I taught your car is burning. Yeah, you taught right. You taught right. I wonder if I can assist this guy with some fire nitro. Here, you need some fire nitro, man. You need fire nitro in your life. Ah! No, I don't need it. I don't need fire nitro. Just him. There we go. Look at you. Oh, it's on fire. Uh! I'm sorry. I can get rid of this. Look, you guys, you just gotta get in it and drive it. It's not drive- Honestly, I thought everybody would've wanted fire nitro right there. Is this what normally happens at car meets? These guys just took my car and they're doing donuts in it. I guess I deserve that, though. Ow! Alright. On to the next one. So this one is how to take- uh, Stop. Relax, everybody. Relax. Alright, like I was saying, this next one has to do with, uh, taking the wheels off of any vehicle. So, like, the front wheels or the back wheels, without the vehicle, like, blowing up or anything. The only reason I want to try this is to see if you can drive it afterwards, because they don't show you in this TikTok if it can drive. And I'm kind of curious. Bro, this video is becoming so unintentionally expensive. I need to buy a Rhino tank, obviously, because that's what you do when you're a normal person. Ugh, that's so convenient. You can just get your tank delivered right to you. It's Amazon Prime, next day shipping. I'm just gonna get some random dude in this lobby to, to bring me, like, an NPC vehicle. Um, so we can try and rip the front wheels off it. Or the back, I don't care, either one. But the trick is, we we can't let it blow up. Because, I mean, it's really easy to blow up a car with the, with the Rhino. You see what I mean? Like, that's pretty simple. Oh, uh, this is gonna be so hard, I can't even see. I- Oh god, don't look that way. Uh, you know what? Maybe I get him to do this? Whoa, bro. He's having the same problem I was. Yeah. You got it, man. Just- just go slow, though. Just go slow. Yep. Yup. Keep it up. Ooh, wait a minute. Yep. I got the e-brake on. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, yeah. No, no. Oh! 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 It worked! It worked! No way! And it's still drivable! <laughs> oh my god, bro. That is so funny. This- I, Look, look, I, I broke my beak. Look at my, my beak's dragging on the ground there. That doesn't mean- what beak? It's a, the front of a vehicle. I don't know why anybody would ever want to do this, but I mean, you could drive around with a three- This is a three-wheeler now. This is a tricycle car. Y'all ever seen that new tricycle car? We got a tricycle car DLC coming out soon. Just stay tuned. I guess this works with any vehicle, too. I don't know if I would try it on, like, a truck. Are we racing right now? You trying to race me? I'm literally crippled over here with three wheels, and the man's trying to race me. Uh-oh. I wonder if this thing will go faster because it only has three three wheels. It might, right? Because GTA physics are like, if you start to bump around a little bit, you gain speed for no reason. Like, if you hit a little speed bump, 
You go like super fast. Don't know why that's the thing. I'm just a sick guy over here. That's all I know. I'm just just sick. Sick as in like I got a three-wheeler car and that's pretty sick. Bro, I was like, what is this yellow tank doing driving towards me? That's mine. He's just spinning around. Love it. Love to see it. Yeah, don't worry, man. I didn't I didn't need the tank again. It's okay. I really didn't. Oh my look like Bill Gates. What the I do feel like this is faster than like the regular version of this car for some reason. Uh, what was that scream? I tried to scream and it came out like a grunt. Oh no. Oh, I don't feel good. So that was myth confirmed. Oh, it's not what I meant to do. Like how I'm just going about my day and this guy's causing havoc in my tank. Mind you. Yeah, guys, get him. He's terrible. What a terrible person. I'm just gonna look at more TikToks over here. This is just gonna get more expensive. This one is a Comet Retro Speed Glitch. So I guess you unload 30 rounds into every corner of the vehicle. And then you're supposed to, like, kick it as well? I don't know. I've never done one of these before, so we're gonna give it a try, I think. And obviously, this is from Benny's. It couldn't be from anything but Benny's, right? You buy a car from Benny's for, like, $100,000, and then it's, like, $8 million to modify it. Oh, I shouldn't be complaining. It's on sale. $60,000? Psh, never mind. I'm sorry. All right, here's what $60,000 gets you. Uh, just a base model. And then we gotta go to Benny's and get completely destroyed. I think we all know, like, as this thing sits, just stock. It's not super fast. You know what I mean? What are we up to right now? It's like struggling to get to 100. Or like 110, all right? Hey, Benny. I'm here for you to take all my money. <laughs> so happy about it. Upgrade to Benny's. Oh, that... Never mind. That's gonna be a lot more. Oh, that's awkward. I'm... St am I stuck in Benny's right now? Come on. Oh, it's a magic trick. I'm gone. Why am I just creeping out, man? Look at me! Oh my god. All right, so, uh, 30 rounds in each corner. I got you. No problem. I can do that. And then you kick each corner eight times. Why is it so specific? I have no idea. 30? Um, 30 in that side. It's not moving, but that's fine. And then 30 in this one. Oh, it is moving a little bit, actually. I hope it doesn't blow up. 30 and then 30. Yes. Right. That's correct. And then eight. Oh, two, two more, two more. Gotta get, you gotta get the 30. Exactly, Spirit. I like how the, it is kind of working, for whatever that means. No idea. One, two. I feel so stupid. Oh, there. Eight, eight on that one. <laughs> eight on this one. Two. What has my life become, man? I'm just kicking a car in GTA Online. Like, shooting and kicking it. Just because TikTok told me to. Ugh. Seven. Eight. All right, you can't say I didn't try. This is this is as best as it's gonna get. Now, previously we got up to like what 110 with the upgrades that we just did with Benny's and this little glitch thing. Should be a lot more than that. I feel like this might go kind of fast, actually. Well, uh, we might be onto something here because do you see the back tires? How they're like coming through the back fender flares? You see that? That's a good sign. That's a really good sign. All right, let's see what we get up to. I'm guessing probably over 110. If not, I'm gonna throw myself through a window. Oh, bro, it's actually struggling. There's no way. The car is vibrating like crazy. We're doing 100 right now. We're doing 110. It's like 109. It's not even 110. Oh my god. What if I just shoot? What if I just put more, more into the? Yeah, let's try that. I think I might have popped a tire. Yeah, I definitely popped a few tires. Oh, both. Both tires. Nice. You know what? We'll probably actually go faster now. What are we doing? Uh, yeah, sort of. I mean, it's trying to get over 110. That's so stupid. But hey, I do these things so you guys don't have to, right? Now I look stupid, and you guys look smart. You look so smart right now. I love this one. 99% of players st Can you stop calling me, Captain? I'm busy! 99% of GTA players didn't know this. I'm sure a lot of people knew about this. I didn't. So we're gonna try- we're gonna check this out. We gotta go to a police station and park our vehicle and then jump into a corner? All of that sounds weird, but we're gonna do it. Alright, after like five minutes of, of searching, we found the police station here. And a van? Perfect. Wait, 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 sir. Thank you. I'm gonna need that real quick. Also, I like how that just opens for us. Like, we're not- obviously not cops. I mean, I'm some random dude in a pink suit in a van. Like, don't open the door for me. Alright, so let's just ram this thing down in the corner here. Just like that. Not like that. At all. Wow. Alright, then we run back here, and we run and jump at this corner like an adult. Alright, let's do it. Oh, I'm fall- I've fallen? This is- this is exactly what you need to do. What?! There's no way! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. Why is my screen- what? 
<laughs> the clothes are like, oh, did that, uh, what, what happened? You, you, you went through the wall, didn't you? Yeah, they don't like when you do that. They don't like it. That was stupid! How have I never known about that? I was literally like, I look like the dumbest person in the world right now. <laughs> right through the wall. Right through it. I'm doing it again. 99% of people didn't know about this. 99% impossible? I don't know. Oh, it just opens for me. It's like, he's gonna do it again. This sign should say, no teleporting through walls. Private property. <laughs> That would be frightening. Let's go! Mmm, awkward. Alright, get me through the wall real quick. Don't- Yep, now run. Run? No! Well, it works. Uh, we just can't run around in there. So, you know, what's the point, right? Like, that wasn't impossible. Let's move on to the next one. Alright, we got another 99% of, uh, GTA players didn't know this. Um, so we gotta go to the shoe store, uh, obviously. Uh, take care of business at the shoe store, and then somehow get behind a counter, and then I have no idea. Alright, shoe store, right here. I don't know. I don't know if that's a shoe store. I'm gonna be honest with you. It definitely isn't, but... Also, I don't know why I'm in this rusty mobile here, but I'm just trying to scare people away from me. Right, you see a dude driving this with a pink suit on? You're not gonna mess with him. I'm not. Hey, this is a weird-looking shoe store. Hmm. Are we gonna deal with this guy first? Be very gentle with him, alright? Alrighty then. That was enough. That was enough. Pretty gentle. Could have been worse. Private club members only. Nah, man, I'm... Alrighty then. Can I walk in there with this, please? There we go. I'm gonna get... Yeah, we're good. Right, so we have to look at this sign that says look, but don't touch, I think. And then... Alright, we are behind the counter, I think. <laughs> Alright, so once we're behind here, we gotta climb this wall. Uh... Oh, yeah, that's a... Hmm. Oh, water. I like water. That's- that's normal though, right? That you just... And then we have to climb another invisible wall in here. And it's right in front of me. Alright. Oh, righty then. Nice. And then we gotta jump from here. Oh, good. Yeah. Uh, good. And then as you do, you gotta jump over to that secret little door over there. Oh, jeez. I don't know if I can make that jump, man. Can I make that? Alright. I believe you- I'm sorry. Where am I right now? I, am I behind the cash register? Or... I, oh, I can see outside. That's good. I- it's, everybody literally ran out of the- the- the shoe store. <clears throat> like, can I call the cops on myself or something? Wait, I got an idea. That should bring somebody. Just casually gonna burn this place down while I'm in it. Yeah, uh, nobody needs shoes, right? You know, I'm starting to think the cops just don't care at all. They're like, yeah, that's normal for a shoe store to have a little bit of fire, a little, little bit of gun, little, all that stuff. Yeah. Oh, that did nothing. What? Oh, what the? I came out of the Shadow Realm. Look at me. I'm a bartender now. Hey, pardon me. Can you guys get out of here, please? This is now my. This is my area. All right. I'm the DJ, spitting the mean, rude raps and stuff. Oh god. I wonder what this room is. Oh, it's nothing. Great, alright. Alright, I'm gonna blast myself over the counter? No, I'm not. How do I get out of here, please? Anybody? Oh, God! Alright, let's see, moving on really quick, just taking an M&M. &M. No, that wasn't an M&M. &M. That was a go-to-sleep pill. <laughs> I like those. Uh, funniest glitch in GTA 5. Um, I don't know about that, but we're gonna check it out. We need an up and atomizer. I got one of them, so we're good to go. And then we gotta go to this random spot that I don't know how I'm gonna find. I mean, I know they show it on the map, but it's a big map. I think I found it. I, I'm not- I'm not- I'm not sure. I also- I feel like that's a big claim to make, that it's the funniest glitch in GTA 5. I'm gonna- eh, I'm gonna be the judge of that. Oh, I forgot that I've got a barbed wire snowplow on the front of this thing, so... It's- it doesn't go over curbs very easily. Pretty sure the spot is like right here, right? It's like- it's like a ball field or something? Oh yeah, that's it. Maybe? Oh, I wish I knew how to play baseball. This is a cool little spot. Uh, but we're not here for baseball. We're here for this little net and my up anatomizer. Uh, now is there- what's the angle that we're pointing at here? I need to- I need to see this. It looks like he's looking right at the- what is that? The mat? Or- Am I at the right spot? Where's first base? It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a oh, there it is, right there. Found it. Is that it? Well, maybe. I don't know. Let's try. Alright. Alright. I- uh, I need to see that from like a different angle. I don't- I'm gonna record this in the- in the editor, and then we're gonna- we're gonna see it live. Action, watch. I messed up, of course. One more. Oh my god! Ah! Alright, we're in the editor. Are you ready for this? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, jeez. Alright, go. What happens? Oh! 
Oh, how do I live through that? What? Wait, no. Bro, I'm literally like an octopus. Look at that! My man said, yo, put me in a suitcase real quick. <laughs> that is stupid. Literally look like I don't have arms or legs. Oh, jeez. Uh, yeah. Alright, that's funny. That- I'm- I got the stupidest smile on my face. That was- 99% of players find this funny. Beautiful rainy day for this next one here. This is the most surprising glitch in GTA Online. Oh, really? So we gotta drive to Franklin's house. We're already here. Right, just standing on his new car out front. Uh, run to the back of the house and then lean against the window. This sounds weird. So we lean against the window and then join a job. Hey, Lamar- Lamar's like, you at my friend's house trying to break in? Yeah, maybe. Oh, look how cool I look right there. That's me. Hey, all right. Maybe the mirror has something to do with it. So I'm gonna lean on the glass real quick, and then you open up your cell phone and go to job list. No jobs available. That's awkward. Um, uh, oh, I have a job. I've yes. Okay. Uh, yep. Gerald. And then get out of it. Get out of it. Back out of it. How? Am I get out of it. I got out. Of I got. I, I backed out of it. Ah, ooh, um, hmm. Ah. Try that again real quick. Uh, join it and then leave instantly. Whoa, whoa, wait! <laughs> Am I better than everybody else? Why does the mirror look so much worse in here, bro? The farther away I was, the better it looked. I, I, am I- I'm Franklin now, right? Or- This is odd. It, it- Being in online and being in here is weird. In single player, totally normal, but I- mm, Even after all this time, there's things that I haven't done, and this is one of them. Why does it look so good in here, though? You know? Well, the kitchen looks kind of weird, actually. Oh, yikes. Yeah. Well, uh, you know, hey, you can't win them all, right? What is- Couch is just floating on two tables and inside another one. Nice. That's normal. Can I just walk out the front door? Ta, ah, that would be too easy, wouldn't it? It definitely would. All right, we got. I gotta get out. Of, I gotta get out of this house. I have to get out of this house right now. We got money to make. I, I found. I found a pretty cool one here. All right. Insane GTA glitch! Exclamation mark. Go here. Uh, climb over this wall, and then there's just bags of money in this little room. I uh, yeah. I need some of that. No, I don't need it. I want it. I got it. I'm having a lot of trouble right now finding, like, the exact spot where this person did that. Uh, there's a lot of, like, different angles, and I don't even know where I am. Uh, maybe I found it right here? I don't- I don't know, bro. Th this whole building looks the exact same, you know? Like... I was gonna say something, but I ended up falling, sorry. Uh... No, no, no. Alright, I think I got it. I- I think I got it! Oh! There's the room! Where's the money, man? Every time with these things! Oh, now they think they're funny, huh? Because I'm stuck in this room? This, <laughs> why does this exist? Alright, th th this one's gotta work, right? Definitely. Best location in GTA- deleting in 24 hours. This was uploaded years ago. This guy's not deleting it, right? But I'm gonna go look, because I'm- well, I'm stuck, but nothing a bullet can't fix! Alright, so we're heading to a gas station. It's kind of fitting, actually, that we're in this car right now going to a gas station. I feel like it's not very good on gas. Yeah, it's not good on gas. What am I saying? Look at this. It's stupid. I like it. It's dumb. Some of the best things in the world are dumb, though. Look at me. Huh? <laughs> Wink. I'm winking. All right, let's pull up real quick. Excuse me. Now, let's not panic, all right? I don't know if they tinted the glass or what, but I can't see in there right now. So we're gonna- we're gonna hop around here and then jump up this way. Uh, and then... <laughs> where's my- where's my money, man? I don't even- The amount of times I've been lied to about these best locations? It, like, what do I expect? What do I got here instead of money? We got little ice cream bars, that's it. They don't even look like- they're the size of me. Oh my god. At least I'll probably be able to get out of this- just kidding. Just kidding. Never mind. Alrighty then, never mind, it let me out. I walked into it enough and it just pushed me through the glass and I- and I- I, bl I blew up. You know how we have this regular phone right here? How you can go to the internet, and then you go to like, Legendary Motorsports, and you can buy whatever you want? And it costs money, right? Like 2.8 million dollars. That's a lot of money. You see Soup over here, you see that guy up there? He's got his own phone. But on his phone, he has a website, like Legendary Motorsports, and he can buy things on it. And we're gonna start it off today with the Off-Road Zentorno, which costs 9 million dollars and looks amazing. There he is. Dude. <coughs> oh man, that. 
looks really, really good. What the... This looks like something copy and pasted out of Fast and Furious, bro. Now, it might look cool, but how does it actually... Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. I was gonna say, how does it handle off-road? Probably... Yeah, I'd say pretty amazing. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I mean, nine million dollars, bro. I'd pay that every... every day. All day, every day for this thing. Literally. I'd pay nine billion if I could. An off-road supercar that looks this good? And soup fell out? That's fine. He, he doesn't like off-roading. It makes him sick. Look at how this thing handles. I'm just kidding. Wait, stop looking. <laughs> Avert your eyes. Oh, God. It's a little powerful, but that's what happens, you know? Oh! This next one here is called the Aqua Caravan, and it costs 2.85 million. You know, I I can't say I've ever thought about taking a uh, a camper uh, in the water, but now that I have, I, I don't know how life was without it. For $3 million, you can bet your bottom dollar I'd be buying this thing, right? Compare this to a yacht for a second. Look at the yacht, just sitting there looking all pretty. Can't do anything with it, can't drive it, just sits there. This thing, psh, take this wherever you want. And by where, wherever, I mean like literally anywhere in the water. You can't, you can't take it where- oh. See, now that right there is why you wear your seatbelts in your caravan. Hey, soup bought himself one too, look at that. All right, his is a little bit cooler than ours, but- Hey, where are we going camping, buddy? You wanna go camping up here? Uh, there's a good jellyfish swarm. I don't know what you- do when you camp in a camper on the water. Jellyfish, maybe? Like, you know how you look at animals when you're camping normally? All right, on to the next one. You know how you can buy, like, office buildings and apartment buildings and stuff like that? Uh, well, have you ever wanted to drive one? Uh, Soup can buy an FIB building for $50 million, and he can drive it, clearly. So, um, let's see. Oh, there's a building in front of me right now on a beach. Yeah, that's an entire building. No way. All right, now bear with me. This is- I haven't driven a building in a long time, so... All right, let's head over to the city and try and uh, blend in with the rest of the buildings. Bro, look at how tall this thing is! What the- <laughs> That looks like the end days is coming. Everything is normal. Hey, is that another FIB building? Hey! I'm about to crash into this other FIB building. There, there can only be one. There can only be one FIB building, and I'm gonna take him down. I just missed completely- wait. There we go, yeah. Oh no. Oh, is this how FIB buildings are made? Oh, he's in- ew! Alright, other FIB building. Let's team up and get rid of the real FIB building. Ready? There it is right there. Look at that thing. Look at it all stationary and not being able to move. What a weirdo. What a weird building. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm falling inside the FIB building that's flying. Oh! Wow, that is genuinely terrifying. That looks like the world is literally ending right now, man! Stop doing that. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like this is a movie The Rock should be in or something. Uh... Moving on to the next one here is the Monster Ambulance, coming in at 4.5 million dollars. That doesn't seem like very much money for a monster truck ambulance, if you're asking me. Especially for something that looks this good, right? Hey, say somebody's on a mountain somewhere, right? We need to get to them? Oh no, we have nothing. It's just kidding. We have a monster truck ambulance. I feel like every hospital needs a, a monster ambulance. That... That doesn't sound good, actually. Yes, yeah, so this is 911. Don't worry. We have the monster ambulance on the way. It's like, what does that mean? This is, what is this, Halloween? I'm not gonna sugarcoat this. It's not amazing off road, you know? At the end of the day, it's an ambulance with some off road uh, tires, wheels. Well, not really off road, more so like monster truck. It'd be great at jumping things, right? Like this right here. It's really good at that. Monster trucks are great at jumping. Sometimes they flip, though. You know what I think the real point of this monster ambulance is, or would be, is this right here. Literally just driving through traffic. Oh, I gotta get to the hospital, sorry. You can just drive over cars, say so traffic's terrible, right? And, at that point, you're creating more business, right? You're, you're crushing people, you're, you're running them over, and you're like, Oh, I'll come back for you, and you just throw business cards out the window. Uh, next up here looks like we have the enhanced golf cart. Price, six million dollars. Really? Nice, Soup. That was my truck, man. Nice. Here's the enhanced golf cart. Uh, I'm not sure if I'd pay six million dollars for this, because I don't have this many friends to take golfing with me, right? Because, like, you could have your best friend sitting here, your second best friend back there, like, right? And you could be- you could be at the front here, driving them all around, like, Hey, let's go golfing! Actually, let's go pick some people up real quick. Uh, all right, yeah. I thought- I thought that's what I saw. I thought- what is that, like, cotton candy? Like I said, because I don't have any friends, we could pick these guys up. Hey, man! Get in! Let's go! This is why I love GTA so much. You can literally just pull up to a random person and be like, Hey! Get in my golf cart! And they just will. Hey, man! Oh... Wow. Yup. There's a bunch of me- Uh-oh! Oh, yeah! Get him! Get him! Listen, bro, I know you got a supercar, but get in. <laughs> 
Everybody's getting in. This is easy. I'm just gonna take all of my best friends. Dude, look at <laughs> What am I doing in the passenger seat there? Just flipping everybody off. All right, we made it to the green, boys. Look at us. We're not actually gonna play golf. We're just gonna drive around on it because I don't know. And that was short-lived. Very short-lived, actually. Like, instantly short-lived. Couldn't have been any shorter if we tried, really. Well, we're all gonna drown now, so that's fun. I'm just- um, Just kidding! We're fine. Wow, the city looks so good from a, a golf cart with all your friends, right? I don't- Uh, The golf cart looks so good going away from you while you're falling towards the city with none of your friends. Am I gonna land in a swimming pool? Uh, whoop. Just kidding. No swimming. Wait a minute! Am I a ghost? Huh? Uh, I rose from the dead, everybody. Look at me. I'm a, I'm a real-life zombie, but like just in a, in a video game. Uh, what are you doing? What are you doing, huh? I I I I I I, I, I oh, I'm lagging. Next up here, while well, I'm literally covered in the most amount of jelly I've ever seen in my life, is the Super Panto for 2.5 million dollars. That's actually not much money. Real question: Would you pay three million dollars for this? I'd probably pay like five or six, maybe even more than that. Honestly, this thing looks like it belongs in Toy Story, dude. What in the world? I so many options for Rockstar for DLC, man. Look at this thing. It's huh, I maybe even five million actually. I would probably spend. When you have a smart car that's this fast, oh my! I like how they just stole the golf cart. <laughs> and there's just a cop driving in the back of it. What is going on, man? I think that's like literally the best angle on this thing. Oh man, that looks neat. Yeah, I just said neat. I'm an adult. <laughs> That's neato. I like how this guy in chat's just now realizing that there's a policeman in the golf cart with them. Uh, this next one here is called the Monster Train, and it's only three million? I don't, uh, I feel like that should be more, right? It's a train. Uh-huh. Yeah, you could, you could charge me however much you want for this, and I would buy it. However much. I don't care. That is, I'm going right to a train track right now. How is it that fast? What the? I've got to assert dominance over the, the regular train because I'm, I'm a train that's evolved, right? That's- that train's gonna tr stay on its tracks. Me? I can go anywhere. Well, other than, like, the water or the sky. I can drive on the roads. Honestly, if they came out with a train DLC, that'd be kinda cool, I think. Like, even just a train that you drive on the tracks. That'd be neat. See, this thing takes a jump. Oh yeah. Not bad. <laughs> Here we are. Natural habitat on the train tracks. Let's see. Where's the train at? I bet it's scared. It's like, why is that one red and it's got wheels? Oh, would you look who- who showed up? An hour later, literally. I've been sitting here for so long. Are you scared, huh? You scared on the Alpha train? Oh my- that literally couldn't have been any more violent. Soup just took the train- are you in the train right now, Soup? Yeah, you are, aren't you? All right, train DLC incoming. Hey, look, they're kissing! Look, the trains are kissing! <laughs> Ooh, gross! Oh, nice. Yeah, let's go, man. Holy mother- Oh, that's frightening! Oh my god! That's a fast train. Oh, Yeah, that's... That's not fair. Right, this next one here, we have a land jet ski for $690,420. <laughs> I, I would... That's a good price. I feel like this is all backwards right now. We were, we were in a, a, a caravan that's a boat, and now we're driving a, a Sea-Doo on land? This isn't super odd, though, because there, there is kind of like a a four-wheeler Sea-Doo type thing that exists. It's not this fast, though. Oh, All right. That was... Soup just hit me doing mock chicken. So I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Never mind, I was gonna rip him off that, but it... Alrighty, then. I'm actually curious. How, uh, how well does this thing float? Probably... probably pretty bad? Mmm... Uh, oh, it... it doesn't float. Bad sport, you destroyed somebody's personal vehicle. Uh, next up here, we have the Blazer Aqua Gang, coming in at 20 million dollars. That's actually kind of a bargain, considering. Boo, look at that! Huh? Wait a minute, I've got a question. If you activate the, uh, the, like, amphibious mode on these, do they all work, or is it just the one? Because you could have, like, six of your homies and you up in the front, and then just go in the water. I don't actually know- oh, that's how you do the aqua mode. Alright, let's see. Hold on. Taking the hard way to get in the water here. Just at- there we go, I got it. No way! <laughs> they're, they're all kind of underwater right now, but that's fine. They're waterproof. They don't even care. <laughs> Soup's just getting drowned right there. <laughs> oh! Oh! I hit, like, the little most poopiest dock in the world. Oh. 
Wait a minute. Can I activate? Oh, <gasps> you can activate the mode on that too? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Let me get on all of them and act <laughs> activate it really quick. Wait, wait, wait. Don't go yet, soup. All right, go. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. The placement on this one is kind of weird, though, because, well, get off. It's mine. Hey, everybody. Hop on, guys. Let's go for a ride on the ocean. What is that guy doing over there? What is that guy doing? Is he trying to blow up the... <laughs> all right. Hey, buddy, you seem like the perfect candidate. Get on one of these things. Let's go. I like how they all pick the ones right behind me. That's kind of cool. All right, let's, uh... We gotta find the water. The guy behind me is just shooting into the back of me. That's all. <laughs> it's a little... But on the sides... The, the guys on the sides, that works. And then me in the middle here. That's just really loud. And it kind of hurts my, my brain. Wait a minute. <gasps> wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, we got five stars really quickly there. Oh! Wait, guys, wait. Oh, stop shooting. Stop, stop. Oh, this is unstoppable, bro. Look at this. It's... Oh! Where'd they go? <laughs> where where did they go? Wh Woo, let's go, boys. We're back at it again in the water. Why is there a submarine right there? Wait a minute. What is that doing? Is that just... All right. That right there is the view, everybody. Look at that. Huh? Just the boys hanging out on their aqua blazers. Just making our beach landing here. The cops are like, what is this? Oh, righty then. Uh, oh, I'm up again. Uh, what? Hey, you guys are doing great. You're doing a great job. It's great. Yep. Oh, it's a sandstorm. Look at that.